there's no place to escape to. This is the last stream. On the left. <laughs> That's when the cannibalism started. I don't think I'll be able to talk much for the rest of the episode. I used up a lot of my breath on that. That's fine. Okay. Yeah, that's hey, fine. Man, that's you, fine. Right. You got, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it easy. If you, you got can't pulled talk, in. as long as you can oink. Okay. Oink. 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 Actually, I had a lot of people ask recently where the ham chant came from because it came from Classy Night Out, but Classy I don't, Night In. Classy Night In from COVID years. Mm-hmm. My question is, what the? Why did we do that? Remember, I I was gifted like a 13 pound prosciutto during COVID. That's right. And I didn't know. I didn't. I never had a chance to open it because it was just Julie and I. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm not gonna open a 13 pound prosciutto. And so, but and then it's I kept it in my fridge and I'm like, when is this party gonna happen? When's this prosciutto party gonna never. happen? And it never happened and it's spoiled. But I kept it. <sighs> and so I just like and I would bring it out during class and night in and I'd spank ham, it ham, and ham, stuff ham, and I'd show ham, it to ham, people. Ham, ham, and it was ham, like ham. my yep. pet ham that I kept in the back of the fridge for a long time and another, then it started to leak you see it's nice though because that's another piece of lore explained yeah, yeah. there you go so there's the ham for you guys you fuckers Cass reads tarot finally renewing my patreon account i can't wait to join you all tonight oh, flame us on the chat all right um jesse watching for my hospital bed can i get a hail good to hail. you what'd you do let us know what happened yeah. is it a tonsillectomy did you put something up your butt are you handcuffed to it mm-hmm, mm-hmm. let's find out uh, are Satan's you stealing little- a bed from someone who's sick mm-hmm. honestly because Just for a nap hey <laughs> Winners come first. That's right. All right. So, yeah. Oh, I'm here because I broke my arm. All right. And someone comes in like, I've got every disease. (laughs) Guess what, man? You fucking got in there first. That's America. Baka, baka. I know what I like. Coming at you like a fucking AK 47. Hell yeah, man. When I come in from out of town, I like to find a hospital and just rent a room and treat it like a hotel. Just kind of just, it's (laughs) nice to have somebody else take my piss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wake up in the morning, they check my vitals. It's wonderful. Technically, it would be the most expensive room. In the entire city, very sh- a night. Very chic. Yeah, very yeah. chic. <laughs> Satan's <laughs> little helper. <laughs> Anything. Um, Satan's little helper. I think we need to make a boner check happen today. Let's see if it happens naturally. Do you guys have one? Yeah, yeah I check your boners at home. No, do you have to do a boner check? Yeah, oh, you, gotta, yeah, yeah you gotta stand up. But you, gotta, if you just made oh, it. You gotta show it. Be fine. Oh no, I lost my. No, I'm unplugged. No. I got no boner. I haven't had one around you guys in a while. Wait, you can't hear this. I haven't had a boner around you guys in a while. Yeah, good. Oh no, fine. my thing's um, down here. flat. My boner check ruined my my cans. Well, it's your mandate, so. All right. Toasty! Uh, well, hey! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it's been so long since I've seen that. That's very cute. Whoa, where'd you get that? Oh, that's so cute. Well, that's... So now, well our, it was in honor of our, of our good buddy, Bird Luger, Kevin Barnett. There's going to be a section of the show dedicated to him later. And that's Perfect. extremely it, sweet. Um, It's been five years since we lost him, and we're very, very sad. Yes, that's right. Um, so I'm going to try to make it happy. Uh, you know, like that. But! Great. First, <laughs> I like chaos. Oh, wait, and Jesse says I've been vomiting nonstop for a week. It's swell. Honestly, it sounds kind of cool. great. It Plug it up, baby. Serious. Yeah, 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 yeah. Serious. Tums. Did he eat Tums? Do you think he had Tums? To, to stop the constant vomiting? Tell the nurse to try Tums. <laughs> It's chalk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and don't keep the internet too close to your uh, your your blood machines. Yeah, you get 5G poisoning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, so I want to kick this pig off. I'm a ham guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. I don't know who that is. What, uh, Eric said he found some ham news this morning, and he put it in there. Uh, Dan Campbell, Detroit Lions head coach. Oh, oh the Detroit Lions Campbell, head coach. Here we, here. Man, I took some, speaking of sick people, I took some shit for uh, the, I, just, I was like, I, yeah, how come every... Uh, Detroit Lions fan looks like a Make a Wish kid. I mean, like, have you seen these guys? <laughs> hey, like, it's ah, nice Bill, for them. Bill. Like, God. I wasn't. Ta- everyone got real mad at me. It's I hard mean, there, man. The, the director, water's poison. Yeah, our director Eric looks like he hasn't seen the sun in years. He's a, he's, <laughs> a <laughs> he's a professional. I'm a ham guy. He's a professional, and his job is to stay inside. But everyone I, got really mad at me, and then, so I was just like, hey, you know, I mean, just uh, vitamin B complex. I'm gonna go ahead and say those. Since the Dolphins are out, we're I'm gonna say it as co CEO. 
We are a Lions Network. I'm full Lions. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm we're full, got, we're full I'm Lion we're Podcast full Lions. Network. I yeah, said I'm at the fine very beginning it. of the season, at the very beginning, I'm going to be a Lions guy this year. Isn't after they great? fucking, after they beat the fucking Chiefs, fuck them. That's when I said, I'm going to be a Lions guy. And you know what? They're going to the fucking Super Bowl. They're going all so. the way this year. Fuck the Niners and their stupid high knees. And the Chiefs especially can Guys, go this suck is getting no fucking Tom. very, very <laughs> yeah, straight. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is getting very straight. Barry Sanders is not still on the Lions anymore, right? No, no Barry, Barry Sanders is, yes, he's a starter. Yeah, Barry Sanders is still on the Lions. That would be fucking <laughs> yeah. incredible. Yeah. 65. Yeah. You still get in there. I mean, yeah. he can't talk and he's killed two families. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? He's just, but his yeah. leg, it's just his legs work. It's just all, it's nothing but CTE from here up just like like frozen with two knives but his legs go <laughs> just him and Bo Jackson sword fighting something. yeah 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 being like are we on a boat <laughs> oh shit everybody's dead alright well speaking of PP and sword fighting I figure we start off good with a little thing I found and it looks like a motorcycle PP thing a motorcycle PP thing? <laughs> motorcycle PP. It looks like a motorcycle PP thing. And you asked uh, before the show, I accidentally did get to see your list. That was the one I was most excited for. All right, motorcycle, 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 motorcycle PP. You gotta start off good with motorcycle, motorcycle PP. Motorcycle PP. Okay. All right, we got this guy. Cool guy. He's driving a motorcycle. Whoa, what's oh, that? Well, what's that? Mm-hmm. It seems like there's a little. He's got a fire on his A little his fire. Head. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them. Oh, let's blow on his. Oh, don't oh. blow on it. Oh. They're very Get casual about their motorcycle casual. being on fire. Get away. Yep. Yep, and here we go. Immediately. Guy doesn't even hesitate. Doesn't even pee-pee. think twice. <laughs> He's just pissing on the burning motorcycle. Like, that oh, is... I got this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, don't worry. I had five Gatorades. <laughs> I'll, spl- I'll splash this to death. I don't know if it's working. It's you not. Know get it? get your dick out and fucking piss on this too. <laughs> How hot is the flame next to your dick? <laughs> what Blood's is happening? Not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where is this? I'm guessing Detroit. Yeah. <laughs> These are actually, that's the wide receiver, and that's the offensive lineman. <laughs> I was thinking the If son. this guy comes over and he starts pissing on the bike too, I'm going to fucking give you money, Ed. Uh, uh, I mean, yeah. I'm, not, I'm not in control of that this. That would Stop be incredible. On it, yeah, it's ineffective, guys. There's not enough water coming out of your dicks. Oxygen's going to make it work. Yeah, you're blowing on it. Yeah. <laughs> You're just standing next to it's got it's full of gasoline. No, that's an electric scooter. That means Is their that battery electric? just lit, lit oh, on fire. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely that's an electric scooter. That's just the battery that lit on fire. You're still standing next to it. It won't explode. It that, might. Well, isn't that nice? It is nice. Isn't yeah. Nice? Margo asks, can, Mar- 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 ask, can men piss at any time? All I know is I am on blood thinners, so yes. I, I can am, pee almost any time. I'm pretty almost much almost always needing to piss. Yeah, yeah, I can pee at least a little any time I want. Yeah, yeah I, I just did right now. Good. Just a little bit? Good for you, buddy. Uh, yeah, no, I like to choose. Uh, I like to go. Sometimes if I know I'm going to go on a long drive or something, I'll pee no matter what. I'll just go crank a little out. You know, if I, if I go into the movie theater, I'll always try to pee. Always, always pee. Yeah. I always, I went just before we started here. I went and peed just, and it was just a little bit. Just a little bit, but, but it, it was going to get you through the hour. Yeah, it does. Lindsay Necropolis, I have something called a go girl. I could help. I've heard about this. I know people have done the funneling uh, and I've seen it. My question is, is it, does it really work? I've seen, it's the, it's the funnel you put at the bottom of the pee pee hole and then the, for a lady for someone with a vagina uh-huh. and then it whoa it shoots out like and you do it i guess for fun it gets to girl boss your way oh so they can urinal. use the urinal yeah you can stand up yeah, yeah but i've never seen a woman use it at a urinal or someone with a vagina at a urinal man girls peeing in public is so much fun man because mm. it comes out like a fucking rocket ship man. yeah it really did I yeah. sometimes one time we were in coney island it was for a uh, murder it was for a burner fish show out in coney island and we were about to get back on the train, which is like an hour and a half ride back yeah. to Brooklyn. And uh, Jackie and our friend uh, Madeline had to take a piss. And so they're like, Art Marcus, like, shield us. And I'm like, okay, cool. Like, I'll. You're, th- you're not the right person. You're too skinny. Well, I was the well only you had one a around. blanket. Yeah. yeah, I was the only one around. <laughs> and, <laughs> he had a long arm span. But I was still like a foot away. Yeah. But I was wearing flip flops. Oh, no. And my. Oh, they were God. shooting at you? They were ass at you? Uh, they should have been face at you. Yeah. But that's the thing. I didn't. None of us wanted to look at each other, and they didn't want to look at me, and I didn't want to look yeah, at yeah, them. Yeah, they have to have this look face. Though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like the dog shitting face, though. Wow, so you got a yeah. killie pee-peed. Yeah, I got a killie pee No, my enti- my feet were soaked, and I had to ride all the way back to Brooklyn. <laughs> Some guys like an would hour pay a thousand dollars for this. Like the this. fucking 10, 30, 11 o'clock uh, yeah. F train or D train, whichever, uh, with just soaked in piss. Are people, I feel like- are people hard at home? Are you guys hard? Yeah. Boner check. Boner check. 
All good. Still good. Come. Yeah, no, it's just the pants. Yeah. Yeah, so good. It's just the pants. Yeah. Just the pants. They bunch up sometimes. All right. Well, I like it. I want to keep it chaotic. I want to keep this show moving because I got some stuff I want to get to. Here, like I um, say, Satan's little helper. Fun fact, I'm a male nurse. And let me tell you, a lot of the time, female nurses have a hell of a time trying to find the urethra of a female patient to insert a catheter. Great. Cool. Cool. That's actually a great thing. Great knowledge to know. Because then you don't just go. <laughs> yeah. You just take a tube, you blow. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah, you got to siphon it out, right? And or like goes? scare like a woman. Stealing gas. Sometimes if you scare a woman, she just pisses us automatically. Yeah. A little like bit. a frog? No, but sometimes I've seen this. Ah, man. <laughs> ah, you've never seen these commercials? The thing, wearing like a, it's more of a feminine. It's like a thicker panty, but it's not a diaper. So you're saying, so you're saying that women there pee is, more than men involuntarily. So there is a, a product out there that is for women who get scared easily. And they can use this. Freddy pants. The fr Freddy pants. You never seen? Called? Yeah, have you ever seen Freddy I pants? I know about the. That's not real. That's not. That's not the actual name. But. There's underwear that's like good for periods. I know that much. But yeah, then they. Yeah, but then yeah, it that. got everyone sick, and they recalled it. Well, you could just shoot into that, and shoot into that, and shoot into that, and shoot into that, and then I think you have to burn them. Isn't mm -hmm. it great how much we know? This is all about what <laughs> you guys don't know. What we men. know. This is three married men. <laughs> know a little thing about female a biology. Bit. All right. Yeah, a little bit. Hamantha, Henry, how do you feel about? Your sister peeing on Marcus's feet. It wasn't on purpose. No, it wasn't. No, yeah, so. it wasn't any sort. No, it yes. wasn't supposed to happen like that. Albert Fish and Chip says, I dated a girl who enjoyed when I pissed her on her in the shower. That happens. Yeah, yeah. shower's a great place that's to not, pee. On that's person. where you do that. No. That's not what I'm saying. Yeah, no he, one's answered the question about if the Go Girl actually works. So oh, continue. yeah. So if you guys are using a Go Girl, maybe we should get a Go Girl for the studio and just leave it next to the toilet. <sighs> I'm going to get letters. Let I mean, me ask you this. So is, many people. So it's just so many. The, is it better girl. to have your feet pissed on in a shower or in an alleyway at Coney Island? I was going to say, what are you if going you're for? horny for it, alleyway. Yeah. If you're if you're just doing someone a favor and letting them get off on peeing on you, shower. Or if you're right. just, or if you just <laughs> piss it. Sometimes it's not sexual at all. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes it's just a nasty accident. And yeah. That's okay, too. Yeah. There it is. Yep. Yep. No, yep, it is. Yep, I love it, girl. Don't it is definitely it. a female funnel. Don't is take that, life sitting down. Don't. Is that like a can of soda with it? That's what it yeah, comes Yeah, can we, should we do a she-we <laughs> poll? <laughs> All right, let's do a she-we poll. Let's find out if people use a go-girl. We're going to do a poll and find out if they've used a go-girl and if they've actually um, if they com a p pissed a culmination without destroying their pants. Yeah, yeah. and also go-girl... Hit us up if you want us to advertise for you. Yeah. Dudes can use them too. Yeah. All right, because I'll just piss at them. That's true. You know I'll what? stick my dick in balls. That's the and thing. And piss through the funnel, right? You know what? That could be a way around public indecency. Ooh. Is that if you fit your dick in balls? Decency shield. Yeah, decency shield. Exactly. Whoa! Wow. And then no one can see it, and you can piss anywhere. <laughs> yeah, that's interesting because it's the. Because you get in trouble for it's whipping out your dick it, and your balls. It's yeah. not the not piss. Not for throwing a bunch of piss everywhere. It's yeah. not the piss. It's not the Semantics. Issue. Although sometimes there is... Yeah, I could stuff in there. Yeah, I'm not Figure fucking... It out. Yeah, yeah I'm not, I could stuff up in there. But Lexington on the other hand, skill, the aiming, though, is that... That's the thing about the aiming is that you're just going to end up with wet balls. <laughs> oh, yeah, for <laughs> sure. <laughs> I already do. Yeah. Lord knows. You guys want to see um, some drunk fellas try to... Uh, Try to have some fun in the anything but piss in the lobby. These yeah. kids, I, I'm sure they peed on themselves, but I don't know for sure. Let's see. All right, having a good time here. These okay. guys are wrestling. Oh, been, there, been there, been there, having yeah. fun. Yeah, just being being bros. Uh -oh. Oh, 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 no. oh no, certain death. Uh -oh. Yeah, well, um, that is life death. Yep, so they're dead. That's really. It cool. might have a good ending. <laughs> That is good. <laughs> they may they may have survived. That. They might. They're they definitely have. going ahead. It's a 50 50. It's a 50 50. It depends I mean, it's, on what floor it is. It I mean, yeah. Second floor. floor, it's fine. I Second really floor know. is tough as well. It's tough. You're not getting out of it prepared to go to Six Flags. No, no. <laughs> no, also, everything's shitty fun. elevator doors. Yeah, very right? bad. Yeah. I blame the elevator doors. I think, yeah, they should have just held up. And not been able to fall through. I I feel like that that was it's not good. Mm -hmm. No, I don't you know? think it's the guy's fault. Uh, yeah, you shouldn't fall through an elevator if you just happen to like trip and stumble like Chevy Chase style. You should bounce off of it because yeah, that, yeah they're hammered and they're probably not going to be able to get like legal fees because they were visibly intoxicated. I think they're in China. Mm, no, I'm not sure though, but I'm pretty sure it was China. Anywhere. So you mean to say it was like an illusion? 
Like it was like one of those things where it's like behind that was the picture of the guy stopping the tanks in Tiananmen Square, but no one's supposed to see. Um, Serenity, I dated a guy who used to put his phone while he was it was recording in a baggie, and he would have me pee on it all the time. Good for him. Cool. Huh? Hey man, he's being responsible. He's got to answer emails all the time, huh? All yeah. the time. I figure you only need like one or two of those. I figure five maximum. They got to be all the same. No, so yeah. eventually you're like again. Like again. Isn't that what glass? I'm trying to read my magazine for? here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's sustainable. Because you yeah. have to keep throwing out these Ziploc bags. That's bad for the environment. That was always the rumor with Lou Reed is that he loved sitting underneath a glass coffee table and having a woman take a big fat dump on it. Oh, hey. man. Man, hey, we knew his Velvet name, Underground came from somewhere. We could have gotten to the bottom of that. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be more like Lou Peed. Oh, oh, yes. There we go. I just work here. All right. There is a new-ish sport. I'm sure you guys have seen uh, footage of it before, but uh, the championships were recently, and I figured it'd be a good idea to share some of it with you. It's kind of a new alternative Russian sport. Mm-hmm. Um, I, uh, you guys into the slap fighting? Love slap fighting. Yeah, you slap know I love fun. slap fighting. Yeah. All right. I brought this up the other day. You know, also I was I want to show you a video of again. Have you ever seen that thing where it's a cord? And two guys wrap their ears around it back and forth, and they yank and they yank. That, and they yank. that one's rough. That That's one's good. really wow. rough. We should look that up. I, I was going to go with uh, the car fighting. You've seen that? No. Oh, it's just they lock two guys in a car and they just fight. You know, That's like, awesome. Yeah, yeah. I have Man, seen that. Got, it's really cool. Time, There's some time, things time. that they have better ideas for. <laughs> like, that's a good idea. <laughs> but I love these slap fights because it's slapping, and you're like, oh, you know, who cares about slapping? But it's fucking intense. No, it'll bra- it is gonna, it's going to give you fucking brain injury. Yeah, yeah, so one of these guys is clearly better than the other. But let's, uh, let's they got, they're producing the shit out of it now. Let's, let's go to it. Let's go. I love slap fights. This is a, it's got some blank to it. This guy, look at Ooh. my hand. Bob, my this. head. See how much I slap? <laughs> look at how thick the slapping calluses are. How does he train for this? I mean, he slaps a bunch. Okay, I okay ladies and this gentlemen, it's time for the tug first of war. Five. The ear tug of war is an Alaskan Eskimo man. And hey, good evening, everyone, and welcome to Ooh, Slap Fight right. Championship right. 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 Underground. Right. 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 My name is Lisa Austin, alongside Daniel Jubinski for seven slap fighting contests, two of which will be title matchups, Daniel, as well as two slap ass contests as well. Yes, I'm very interested in how it will look like tonight. We'll have what are the names? Is the back underground to make sure uh, when you they uh, catch you, you. Will, you know, yeah. yeah, they catch you. I already tell some, you. Need uh, specific uh, atmosphere. And then one guy jerks off. Look at yeah, this guy. Henry, who are you going for? Bacchus or evolve, Piccolo? I like to this guy. I like I the, the Piccolo. Okay, I like Bacchus. The, the little right fucker? Yeah, I like the little guy. I like Piccolo. He reminds me of the cop from Breaking Bad. Whoa, look at him squish his tips together. It's awesome. Yeah. I know. He's very insane. He also looks like the Armenian guy from Barry. Yeah. Chicken? Oh, okay. All right. See, uh, that just it's, made him happy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, he, he got turned on. Please do not hit him again. He gets angry and he kills everyone. There will be. Uh, I would draw. rather get slapped that, first, uh, I think. Emma says it's being bold a requirement. Yes. A, yeah, I believe so. Yes. So the hand can slap. Can you have to be angry. You don't have well, hair. I think that he's gonna need it. In a I ain't angry. You don't gotta be angry, man. It means you have a sign. Look at these guys. Almost. They're all bald, aren't they? They're all jacked as fuck, dude. This is a high yeah. testosterone man. We gotta get it. We gotta do this at home. A slap, an LPN slap fight? Yes. Now, me and my buddies used to do it in college. It always, someone always gets their feelings hurt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it also, I mean, if I, if I, if I would do anything to slap all them once. Yeah. Can you imagine? I don't know if he can take physical contact. No, I don't think. No. He's talking about this guy. He's gonna go down like a fucking. Look, look at the, his hand is the size of his fucking head. Now, sure. Bacchus knows how to take a punch. Hit. That is a take big a slap. Oh, for sure. Yeah. I mean, he got okay. this far. He yeah. got to right. this room. Go. Boom! Oh, shit! Okay. Wow! Well, Bacchus did not do great. Well, he's yeah. still, he did he's good. He's, he's doing fine. He's, he's, fine. Fine. he's fine. He's, he's fine. He's fine. He's fine. He's Oh, yeah, he's fine. He's, he's fucking He's not going to be able to do his taxes this year, but he's fine. Yeah, but considering how Piccolo did move a single millimeter. Yeah, we should really do this for real, where we should get one of these and strip all the commentary off on it, and we just do an entire episode. A slap fighting? Yes. I would love this. Because I love this. This is a show. This is so much better. 
better than the fucking election? <laughs> well, <that's, laughs> this is just, this <laughs> is real <laughs> content. This I'd is like, real yeah, stuff. I'd like to know. Uh, oh, shit. You can just see the brain slap the inside of his skull. Yeah, oh. there it goes. There goes his niece's <laughs> birthday. <laughs> When they get that back. Known as uh, Uncle right, Honeyfoot, right, isn't Dana White big into this shit now? Yeah, yes, I do believe so. This is where this comes Brown from, and that is his daughter. Here. Let's see <laughs> what can do this time. Oh, he hits him again. Oh, uh, he just he, got that, mad. No, he's mad now. Because he clipped him kind of front. He kind of clipped him in the front yeah. here. I don't know, but he he's reacted. scared now, dude. This guy's fucking woo. But. He reacted. Piccolo reacted yeah, he, a little bit more that time than he did the first one. He did. No, it hurt him. For sure. He slapped the fuck out of Winnie the Pooh. This guy's a great slap. Yeah, this guy's a great slap. Slapper, uh, okay. uh, gas mask angel no, donation uh, drive where for every hundred dollars Holden gets slapped once. Oh my god. You'll make I mean, millions of dollars. more money than that. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Incredible. Nice mix of Do you think he can get slapped? Holden? Yeah. No, yeah. I don't think he is able to take through his physical pain in any way whatsoever. What if we start with Lex and have his wife slap him first? Oh, yeah. Jim. Nothing. Oh, look at him. Yeah, he got mad though. I don't know if he got mad. He might have bucked a little bit, but. Oh, yeah, it's a foul because he flinched. It's a. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're not allowed to flinch. See? Uh, he's like supposed he to said, just take it. He's pissed. That's why he's pissed. But he's not pissed. He's scared. It's his neck that makes him so able to get hit. Coming in here. But I also uh, but don't. Still, how I do you win, though? Do you just a little bit of a do you pass out? Yeah. How do you win? You'll see in a second. It's the other guy literally is dead. Oh fuck! Yep. Down the butt. He went away. Yeah. He literally like he disappeared as a human for a second. Yeah. Like you saw like when he did a. Yeah. Oh, he is not. Yeah. He's, it's literally he's not boxing for idiots. There's really only so many. <laughs> Truly, there is no way that this sport can continue for a long time. The real Henry Zabrowski. I saw this fight live. It turns out the guy was cheating by having his friend tell him the right moves through a vibrator in his butt. That is a funny call in the chat. Yeah, he, got, he had to get helped off. Uh, yeah. yeah, he had to do it. I guess that will have to just go and slap my wife. Bam! Wow! Yeah. Too, yeah, his his head vibrated into a different dimension. What a oh, fucking! Oh my god! <laughs> what, to uh, what end? How much money could they possibly make? Oh, what is a hundred bucks? I bet it all went to the set. No cabbage for you, buddy. Oh man, the blank stare that he had on his face as he sat on his butt. Oh, yeah, geez. it's legitimate. <laughs> that's brain damage. Yeah, no, that is brain damage. Yeah, that's his brain just like a shockwave through an air and hit a control alt delete got hit and that's not what you're supposed to do you just do a hard restart yeah. on the human brain mm -hmm. yeah i love this i feel like we could do this for a long time we watch all of these fights I'd we take to. out all of the commentary and we just do a commentary Slap fight week i would love it i'd love it uh yeah but we'll we have to do it future. outside of ufc because i you know we're not big into dana white so we have to find somebody else we're gonna they slap fight for fun we can do the car fights too you guys got to see like car, car fights. fights. We'll I, I, I have seen one car fight, and I was quite entertained. Yeah, I'm yeah. kind of disappointed now. Frank that Reynolds says, this is how last podcast should choose interns. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yeah, next track. <laughs> we don't have interns. We pay everybody here. We do. Come. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> On principle. On principle. We don't have interns. Oh, no, man. I want something more like an indentured servant. That they are sure. to be with me and Beholden work with me. To you. Yes, and to yeah. the day that they die, or I die, and then no, they're buried with me. No, indentured servant is someone who they have to pay back the money you spent to get them to America. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. And then once they pay that back, then they're free. Yes, yes. which but is until why, that point. Until that point. That's why we're investing in 25-year-old uh, bikini models from Macedonia. <laughs> to come over here, and we're just gonna push them through. And they're, you know, is, we're gonna teach them how to read. Is Macedonia a real place? No, yeah, idea. I yeah, think yeah. so. Might well, it, might I, be. I think it was at one point. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure oh. if it is anymore. Yeah, Spud. Oh, right, go, 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 Wow. Twenty percent have peed with one. Okay. Eighty percent have not. Do we have data on whether or not it was a positive experience? If it actually worked, we're gonna have to do. Okay, let's do one more. We poll. need to write -ins. Out of those twenty yeah. percent, only those twenty percent, dry 
or wet. Yeah, how, how, dry how were your, or wet. What were yeah. your uh, shoes like yeah. at the end of the process? Spud, based on cursory Googling, you win between two grand and 10K for a win. Wow. wow. Slap fighting. And that's still not enough. That's not enough for permanent brain damage. No, not yeah. to get rocked in the head for I no reason. I feel like that's worse than boxing. Yes. That's so much worse than boxing. Because boxing, you get body shots. At least a lot of times you have your hands up, so you're deflecting some of it. Yeah. And then, like, you're getting body shots. You're getting other stuff. Like, it's, yeah, you're getting rocked you're a couple always times. getting hit in the chin. And when you get hit in the chin, your head moves, and then the brain slams against the side of your uh, skull. Yeah. Have we talked about this, about the uh, sled head? That they were going through with bobsledding, the Olympic bobsledding, like it's this big controversy that they are also getting CTE. Really? It's called because the... bobsledding, they going down like this. They're they're doing a lot of new research to figure out a way to stabilize their heads going down, but it makes them not a good bobsledding. So we Whoa. fucking we ate it. Wow, get yeah, rid I mean, of bobsledding. No, no. I love bobsledding. We just gotta. You I just, love bobsledding. That's the thing. I here's. I'm a Frank my, this sledder. Might, let's. This might be my. It's very nice. <laughs> this might be the middle way. Between getting rid of all this stuff and, you know, going way too far with the CTE thing. How's about the people who play sports in which CTE is prevalent, they continue to play those sports. They're just not allowed to have families. I love this Good idea. idea. Yeah. Sterilize yeah. them. Yeah. Oh, From the very, very top. Yes, I yeah. love Vasectomy. this idea. Don't yeah. let them be an option. Keep mm. them in a cell. <laughs> Pay them a lot of money. Yeah. Have your babies before you play. Yes. No, 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 no. You can't have a family at all. No, oh. we need to breed. But you we can need never to... have it. You can never, like, once you Tom sign Brady on, must breed. They must breed. He no has. family. Yes. He's broke. We need to get his cum. That's why I feel like it's where we get their cum. Mm -hmm. And yeah, we use the get, cum. We use the cum like horses. Yes. God, <laughs> it's so hard not to say Tom Brady jokes right now. Cut, Tom Brady roast uh, May 5th live on Netflix. Yep. Uh, don't say anything. <laughs> no, don't say anything. <laughs> Big <laughs> Herb, Macedonia is where Cleopatra and Alexander the Great were from. Great. No longer a, a location, but it once was. It once was. You know is somewhere it else? maybe Crete now? Crete? Crete? No, Crete's gone too, I believe. No, Crete's there. I mean, I don't think it's called Crete anymore. No, actually, I think um, Ikea bought it. Now it's called Crete. Ah! <laughs> Crete and Barrel! Crete and Barrel. There we go. Yeah. North Maya, Bulgaria, Kosovo. Greece. Yeah. So it is those fuckers. I remember Albania. Kosovo. Yeah, good for them. Yeah, wasn't we have an Olympics there and we fought a war there? I mean, lots of the, Olymp the Olympics started in Greece. Listen, you, you know another place that's not going to be around much longer? Krispy Kreme. Florida. Oh. Yeah. And uh, here's some guy who's going to help us get rid of Florida. Nathan, but Tom Brady needs to kiss his sons on the lips. That's right. Hey, man, that's more kisses than my papi ever gave me. He, he loves kissing would, his children. Would you have preferred your father to kiss you on the lips often? I wish he kissed me with tongue. Wow. Just, to, just, to get a, just to get a whiff of imagining that he cared. Hmm. Interesting. No, yeah. even if the caring was bad, I don't want to be kissed like that. Actually, sounds like you no, do. it's a bit. I was doing a bit. I was doing a bit, but you would not want to be kid. Like if your father, like the next time you saw him, if he like kissed you on the mouth, not sensually, but you know, just in a loving European way, it would take a lot of stuff. Would have to be different. I, I think he's. I mean, at this point, yeah. I, a kiss you, you, from the lips on a dad. Like, the only way it's okay is if he grabs you like this. He's like, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like, the only yeah. way. That's like, he's about way. to get okay. me killed. Yeah, 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 so you yeah, say yeah, the yeah. only like way. He's about he to get... send me on a boat with the guy that I barely know, and then I get shot in the back of the head. Yeah. <laughs> yeah so it has to yeah. be aggressive, fast. And... Or it's a bet. Or it's a bet. Yeah. 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 But who's going to bet? Like, I bet you're not going to kiss your dad. Oh, I'll bet you I will. <laughs> I'll fucking bet you I fucking will. Oh, I mean, the worst part, the even worse would be like, I bet you won't kiss your son. Ooh. A bunch of guys sitting bet around. Bet you won't kiss your son on the mouth. Yeah. Hey, man, that's a, that was a conversation that happened every third day on Epstein's Island. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What an island. You need a new name for that island. Hey, man. Hey, we need a new name. It does need a new name. It does. I, I love it. Brandon Bass. Santa Island. <laughs> Santa Claus Island. <laughs> That's also probably a bad one. <laughs> yes. Anyway, Florida. Fucking <laughs> 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 
man. That's my boy, uh, dude. If you, that guy watches or anyone knows him, please connect him with me. Yeah, I would guess. I'd store his at gmail.com. I, I just want to smoke with him next time, Florida, next time I'm in Florida. Yeah, 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 he gets free tickets to the show and next time I'm in Florida. All next right. time we're anywhere close to Florida, we got to go to the Hulk Hogan. He has a whole like bar now oh, really? on Clearwater Beach that he refuses to shut for hurricanes. He shouldn't have gotten all that money. He's the one that's got DJ. Uh, he's got DJ Skrillex. Skrillex. Oh. No, it's Skrillex. It's S K. Oh, it's a different person. <laughs> yes. Oh, no. okay. yeah. It's a ripoff of Skrillex. 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 Yeah, oh. it's DJ Skrillex. Skrillex. Oh, it's very, very good. Uh, Satan's little helper. Can we get a special Patreon interview with the last podcast and left parents? The only thing is, I don't know if my mom is microphone ready. Yeah, yeah. and we'd have like, to get a Ouija board for mine. Yeah. Hey, man. Hey, that would be interesting in and of itself. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna say no, it's gonna be a no. We yeah. can go to the tombstone. Yeah, my mom was in on brighter side. You can go listen to that. Yeah, and, yeah. and old tables episodes of roundtables. She's yeah, some she, stuff on there. she's been on the show before. And, oh yeah, and it's yeah. probably. I mean, she. Uh, you know, if, if she was alive, she'd be canceled. <laughs> oh. Hey, and I would fight for her First Amendment right to be a, a seven-year-old woman from the Northeast. All right. Okay, speaking of roundtable, perfect segue. It's Bird Luger time. These this is great. Our good friend, Kevin Barnett, we loved him so much. He loved lots of things, and he was very passionate about these things. So yes. I wanted to find videos that I thought he would like and things that I would show him if I saw it. That's yeah. very sweet. That's yeah, very sweet. It's a great idea. So this first one, I think, has uh, needs no explanation. Uh, let's, uh, let's see it. It's a little tasteless, but it's for Kevin. Yeah, these are Kevin. Yeah. These are for Kevin. Yeah, he would like this. He would, would love this so much. Yeah, yeah he, he liked loved Chun-Li. Chun he loved Chun -Li. He talked about Chun-Li so much. Wearing <laughs> um, she got quite the big butt. Yeah, yeah. you know, it, you know, it's her job. I think. Do you yeah. think that? Yeah, I do think that they get sponsored by BBL companies. Like they go when they like they give them a butt lift just for the sake of doing it for the promotion of a brand. Do you think that like are we supposed to not think that BBLs exist? Are butt lifts? There are companies that do butt lifts. Oh yeah. Are, oh, okay. Well, I mean, like they're yeah, brand baby. You ever seen T Tuckus Ruckus? You ever been there? You ever seen this? I've never been to Tuckus Ruckus. Yeah, it's a catalog. Ruckus? Yeah, oh, pick it's out a your catalog. Butt. Yeah, you pick out your you pick out your ass. You can pick out your ass. Yeah. You what? Say like a B, you you can. Yeah. I want Are you model trying 76. to get surgery on your fucking egg body? <laughs> I honestly, I can't, I can't mess with my body algorithm right. because if Whoa. I get a big butt, it's gonna make all my pants fit Fuck different. Marcus's makeover, we're getting you a hiney. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah, man. Why are we spending money on I my makeover? I think I'm fine. I do fine. You're the one with zero. I think I'm fine. The I'm way zero. I am. He's negative. He is negative. Yeah, it does go. It is, okay. I don't need a butt. You know what it is? You know what it is about having a butt? It's that I just feel weird. I think it's in a, like I feel fairly confident. I still walk down the street. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm confident. Boner yeah, check. but what if I took your uh, belt away right now? What would happen? <laughs> oh, you want to see? Oh, no. Here we go. All right. You think it's funny? NSFW. You think it's funny? Oh, Jesus Christ. That is workplace abuse. Good Lord. All right, let's end this bit. I'm confident, but if I imagine if I had a big juicy butt. See? If I had a big, because I got the wallet. Right, so that's a good example. Like, if I had a big butt. Yeah, it's negative. Yeah. But like, this is me sticking out. Right? Like, if I was walking down the street <laughs> and I had a big juicy butt, yeah, yeah, it wouldn't be. Tusty. <laughs> <laughs> I feel I didn't mean to hit you. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's fine. Ah! Speak on the mic. The um. <laughs> All right. So here's a little more classy. Kevin was obsessed with Chun Li. He of loved course. her. He, he loved Chun Li. He would have married Chun Li. He wasn't the marrying type, but he would have married Chun Li. But here's a very impressive Chun Li. If you guys would check this out. This is like a Street Fighter cosplay where they do the moves. Yeah, I feel like this would be something that Kevin would lose his fucking mind. Oh yeah, yeah, he would yeah. be there. Like the actual moves. He'd be a yeah. gun. Yeah. Obviously, she can't you know, shoot a fireball. No. Have you ever watched it? No.
guy with one of the side fight head of heavy when oh, he had Zangief fight, you just give him that mohawk and he's there. Dude, he really would with that Zangief. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You see, this is just fun. Yeah. This, is cl this is very classy. Oh, that's yeah. sad. I don't want to go to like a video game festival, but this, something like this, like a Street Fighter and cosplay, but like... Well, I, I hate to tell you, I mean, it's not going to happen with the tail beat from the Dolphins game. You're going to have <laughs> to go there. what happens down there. <laughs> it's wild. But you're going to have to do a chat wants boner check. But I don't find that. That wasn't that, that wasn't sexy. No, that wasn't yeah. sexy at all. That was just, you know, lady doing martial arts. <sighs> it's fine. That's it. Just, yeah, it's not sexy. It was just honestly, I was more impressed. I actually like. Yeah, no, I find it that sexy. That's true talent. I find sexy in the preparedness that it would take to do that, and how much dedication. I find that sexy. Of course. But that's more of an ethereal, other side. That's not boner popping sexy. That's yeah. like me, like respecting a woman, sexy. Yeah. But now that I think of it, I do think Kevin might have preferred video number one though. Oh, oh very much so. Yeah, no, he would have. Yeah, no, he would not have. No, no, no. He would have asked us to play the other video again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But not have played that. Yes, no, for sure. Um, something, uh, it's for him, Kevin. Yeah. Yeah. It's not for us. Bert Luger in the house. I'm asleep, but I still wonder if it's big. Big. that is a BBL. <laughs> and the reason why you could tell it's a BBL is because the top's big. Yeah? Yeah, the top. It's, it's got... the top. The butt I haven't is learned like, anything about this stuff yet. A I learned a fair amount from this season of 90 Day Fiance. Yes. A yeah. normal big butt is, like, from the bottom. Yeah, but when you get the big, but when your butt is literally like a full C, yeah, that's not real. That's fake. Yeah, yeah that's, that's fake. fake. Yeah. Okay. Zach Jeffers yeah. says I'm watching this on a plane next to a baby. It's coming down. <laughs> <laughs> the plane's coming down. <laughs> eat the baby. Eat the baby. Eat the fucking baby. Kill the baby. Kill the fucking baby. Open the door. <laughs> open the door. Go to the. Go to the door. Open the door. <laughs> oh man. Man, I remember one time. I got on an airplane and there was two women holding like a child and it was like a big kid. And they, they, I, I looked at him. I was like, oh, uh, do what, one of you want to switch seats with me or something? And they're like, no, he's a lap child. And I was just like, this kid's like 70 pounds. Yeah. You know, I was he's like, like, hey, I'm looking at him. I'm like, yeah, yeah, how you doing, man? Yeah. Hey, what's going on? Where'd you serve? <laughs> I told them I also was a lap child, and everyone laughed. Yeah, and then like, I had to sit next to them. Uh, you're, you might be a comedian. Okay. You might be some hot comedian, you fucking big headed piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. One thing Kevin loved Korean breakdancing yes. and backflips. Yes. So Love here backflips. is. Backflip a, master himself. Yes, he could do it. You could do it. You could. So this is a combo. These are the top five suicide breakdancing moves in Korea. What? We about to see that. No, no one does. Oh, Look at that shit. Incredible. That's really cool. Look at that shit. That's number five. <laughs> wow. <laughs> see, their bills are very small. Oh! Look at him. That's gotta hurt your wrist. You can't do that for Oh, yeah, he's gonna have carpal tunnel for sure. It's yeah. bad for your wrists. You gotta stretch. This is what's called sick. Whoa. Look at his leg like spaghetti. Do you know that? Oh, yeah, that's not gonna do good on your shoulder. Ask fucking, ask him. But sadly, you'll have to ask Hulk Hogan what it's like to land on your hip over and over again. What it does to you, it hurts you, it hurts you. You gotta be careful. You guys are not thinking about being 40. This one's called Stewart. Stewart. Oh! Yeah. Oh! You know, none of these guys are thinking about being 40. Oh, none of them know what's coming. Bam! Spuds says, Henry, you're small. You can learn to do this. No, I can't. It requires you have to be like thin. <laughs> do you know that breakdancing is going to be? <laughs> yeah, awesome. That's a great idea. Whoa, that's cool. That, that fucking nut. Look at this fucking nut. Whoa. That's a lot of bait. I think the Koreans are gonna win. They're definitely gonna win. Yeah. Are you kidding me? We're too big. Yeah, we are too big. We're too Anymore. big for this These shit. Days. I'm glad, but it's, it's happening because. The host city always gets to pick one new sport, and L.A. picked breakdancing. That's a great. Whoa, that no. Cool. Oh, no. That. It's right. L.A., it's coming here, isn't it? 2028. Yeah. Ugh, I'm ready fuck. for it, baby. I can't wait. Town. It's four years. Oh, God. we got to prepare to get the fuck out of here. It's going to be a nightmare. Yeah. Do you oh, do you honestly think that they're going to come to the valley? Oh! <laughs> Everywhere we go. <laughs> I'm going to try to get every Starbucks. City. I'm going to see a guy lifting weights. I'm going to go down there. I'm going to go at the fucking, at the Ralphs. I'm going to see some woman going... Oh, I'll take that. <laughs> <laughs> I can't handle this fucking shit. They're coming for our wives. Yeah, I know what they're doing. 
I know what's happening. And those swimmers come out here, man. You can't trust an international swimmer. No, you can't because trust an international swimmer. Because they specifically think about this. You're an international swimmer. Where are there no laws? Center of the water. That these guys don't have rules, but especially when it comes to fidelity, mm-hmm. when it comes to marriage. Mm-hmm. Sure. Amen. You know what else hates fidelity? The peregrine falcon. Bird Luger's <laughs> favorite bird. Yeah. What? Yeah, bird is his favorite bird. The bird hates Falcon. it. Cheats on its wife. If it's a, it cheats on its wife for sure. Yeah. Top five peregrine falcon attacks caught on camera. <laughs> Number five. In this video, peregrine falcon attacks a bald eagle. In the first attack, bald eagle performed a barrel roll and escaped. However, the tables turn in the second attack, leaving the eagle with no chance for a getaway. Yeah, Number four. A fearless Dude, like, peregrine falcon taking on none enough. other than the majestic eagle. A tiny attack from falcon is enough to unbalance the eagle. The Number three. A peregrine falcon attacking the leopard. This isn't just an attack. It's like the falcon decided to show the leopard who's boss. Number two. Don't blink, or you will miss it. Yeah, I can't In this clip, duck, falcon dude. attacking a duck with such precision that it blows your mind in the duck's neck. Yeah. Yeah. So then it comes back and eats it? Yeah. yeah. There's Number one. Video the legendary the clip where falcon turns into a feathered bullet, reaching up to 390 kilometers per hour. It's like a sonic boom <laughs> as it takes down its airborne prey. Just oh. turned it into dust! You can't turn it into dust. That's fun as hell, though. Yeah, yeah, I want to release them, man. At the fucking at the the um, the GOP national convention. <laughs> <laughs> just like imagine that, just releasing like ten peregrine falcons and just watch them like ah, as the falcons go fucking die bombing everybody. That's I'm great. Fun as hell, man. Fucking two hundred miles an hour. That's yeah, man. Insane. That's yeah. crazy, dude. That's bad. That's bad ass shit. They need a ticket. That's the um, that's the Kevin Barnett block. Oh, that's really nice. Mm, very nice. That's really nice, and he would really enjoy all of that. Toasty. <laughs> <laughs> um, so stay. I want to stay with nature. You know, I love my nature attacks. Of I'm course. glad that you know I love nature attacks too. Yeah. Because uh, you know what's nice about nature attacks? You can root for everybody. Yeah. You don't have to sit and feel guilty about whatever. You know, like oh no, it's an old lady getting eaten by the alligator. And it's just like for me, it's like you know, I think it's fun. Yeah. No, exactly. And because anyone can win, especially. When it's man versus anaconda. Yes. Yeah, yeah buddy. Let's the thing about anacondas, so I will say, honestly, kind of put a little judgment from there. Anaconda's hard to fucking, you can get away from anaconda, right? Yeah, they're fat. Yeah. But they're, and they're, you got to go towards where the anaconda lives. You got to be like John Voight. Yeah. yeah. No, you have to go find them. Yeah. So The way I sort of think of it with the animals versus man is that when I'm playing video games, my wife, like Carolina, always asks me, like, when I'm fighting someone, she's like, why is that guy fighting you? And if I just say, I, I don't have an answer, she asks, did you go into his house? Yeah. <laughs> did, you, did, you, did you go into his house uninvited? Yep. And is he fighting you now because you went into his house uninvited? I'm like, well, yes. Yes, sort of. Like, that is the point Would you come and this. look for you if you didn't go into his house? Yeah, he's like, okay, well then this fight is your fault, and that's how I see animal attacks most of the time. Yeah, you go to an animal's house. You go to his house. You're going into his habitat. Fair game. Yeah, of course. You entered the food chain. Yes, I agree. That's why I don't go. Check out this guy. I'm not trying to fight this guy. I stay in the city. Yeah, this shit doesn't happen in the woods. Yeah, deep in his house. Yeah, why would you do this? Leave it alone. Yeah. (laughs) I feel like this is not worth it for the gram. Man, yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Just grabs him by the fucking head. Oh, this guy's. This guy. That's a big motherfucker. You don't, you don't need that Tinder picture that bad. <laughs> Any second now, it's gonna start wrapping around the leg or something. It's already coming. Are these the guys trying to get the anacondas out of the Everglades? I think this is. I don't know if this is in the Everglades. And the anacondas aren't really in the Everglades. It's the boa constrictors. It's the boa constrictors, oh, it's the boa constrictors that are constrictors. killing and the, the gators. pythons. Yeah, yeah. The pythons. Yeah, that's what Trey. That's what Trey. Trey Land Road trying to go down now. Because you gotta go down. You put the doors. You gotta go down now. Now this is the bad. This is the bad part because the, the fucking thing's about to start squeezing his arm. Oh no. He's strong. He's got his choking now. He's very strong. Oh, he's very strong. Santa Conda. He's, he's a viable. Absolute monster. He's a viable man. Oh, this is it. That's kind of cute. That's nice. But he then what is he it. doing with it? He's, these guys, they just like to go catch these things, and they don't really do anything with them. They just catch them and put them back. 
Well, that seems deal. mean for the Anacon. He needs it's to fishing. Read books it's the same thing. Yeah, I guess it is. I guess it is close to fishing. Yeah. It's the same. I guess if we like snakes more than fish. I love snakes. Oh, look at it. What a fun. Yeah. I love snakes. Yeah. That guy's crazy. I love this guy. Whoever I'd he love is. to have a big snake like that just going around my house all the time. Do it. Yeah. Well, nah. once it starts sleeping next to you, that means it's trying to eat you. That's yeah. a myth. No, that's a. It's a myth. It's that's trying to have myth? sex with you. It's trying to have sex. With <laughs> yeah, it's trying to romance you. No, it is a myth though. Apparently. Oh really? Yeah. Oh. It's like it's an urban legend from a something. I don't know. Well, I just know having a gigantic snake. It would be like having a cat, but it's a snake. Because you know, cats just walk around your house. They don't give a fuck about there it. There ain't nothing stopping you, dude. Mm-hmm. Well, except for the fact Georgie, that it's a, a massive. Yeah, Georgie. Yeah, would Georgie. Be eaten. But Georgie would have to figure out how to defend herself. I'm not going to depend on that. Georgie doesn't know how to defend herself against anything. Nothing. That's yeah. nothing no, at all. No, really. No, the circle. <laughs> the circle of life. Not sacrifi- got got. I'm not sacrificing my beloved dog of seven years for a fantasy of a big snake. Well, you know, you brought it up. Yeah. Because I actually am just trying to tell you, you can believe in yourself, and you make your fantasies real. These these snakes are available. Yeah. They're out there. I know what you do? You snake. empty the pool. You put it in there. That's a good idea. Or keep the pool full. Get a water snake. Ooh. Those are usually poisonous. Well, this is pull why... out its sacks. <laughs> Here's a reason why you wouldn't want an anaconda. Okay. Esta jovem sucuri de seis metros. Apareceu you don't want no Rio Jacaré, you want na região no, de Araraquara, estado de São Paulo. E foi arrastada para fora no, da I'm água. Sure em terra, an ela não it's consegue big. se it's locomover big. It, right? por causa do peso like, yeah. e do volume dos principais anéis do corpo. Mad. For sure. He keeps hitting it with the fucking ore. Yeah. That's why he's mad. You can tell it's going to be nasty because of how grainy the footage is. Yeah. yeah that's what it's, what's in there. Oh, maybe if you just rub its belly a little bit, we can find out what's going to happen here. What are you doing? Have you seen this one before? No, I have not. This is a good one. This is a good one. Oh. You know, sometimes, like, you know, for, like when we went out for Marcus's birthday, I had a little too much to eat. Yeah. And I kind of felt like this, too. What is yeah. that? Yeah, no, I, I don't think he's going to be able to keep this down. That's fun. Yeah, what is that? Oh, he's is that Jim Carrey? Yeah. Is that a, a That's pig? its mouth. It, it gets its really mouth wide. Something's coming out of it. Yeah. Is that oh. another snake? No, those no. are, uh, those are, those are hooves. Like two, two hooves. Yeah, those are hooves. Those yeah. are hooves. Yeah, wow. and it's is got it two. dinosaur? Yep. Yeah, it, it is a type of dinosaur. Is oh, what is that? How fat its mouth is getting. Wow, that's cool. Isn't that wild? It could swallow us. Well, look. Yeah, definitely. Oh, it's a boy. Oh, or it was a yep. boy. There's a little penis. It's a piggy. <laughs> it's a piggy piggy. It's, it's my little... question is how do you. I think it might be a little bigger than a piggy. Marcus. Is it dead? Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, it's dead. I haven't mean, spent any amount of time inside Come of a snake. Snake, snake expert here. Dwarf reticulated pythons are really impressive and have great temperaments without being so big as they'd be dangerous if handled alone. Ah. Okay. Is that what this is? Is no. this a dwarf no, python? No, this is an anaconda. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, she's come. talking about, they're talking about the idea of Whoa. if you can have a, a on, snake oh, that can coexist it's coming with out fa- It's coming out faster now. Oh, oh is that a it's hippo? Easy. It's, um, yeah, it's a hippopotamus. Jesus, wow. Lou. This fucking snake swallowed. He must be hungry. A hippopotamus. Oh, you must wow. be hungry. Come, everybody, put his lunch back. Look at, oh. Come on, why didn't fuck? Oh, oh, don't make him fucking, don't shame him. Whoa. Is this bulimia? Oh. Is that snake bulimia? <laughs> is this all because that snake wants to be on the cover of Snake Bikini Magazine? They I pat, pat, patted him. That's they, not fair. They pat, pat, patted him with a roar. Why did they not let him eat his food? Yeah. Entertainment. Mm. That's sad. I'm mad about that. I think because it boring. comes out to that was his lunch. Yeah. That yeah. was he worked hard for that. He worked really hard for that because a baby hippo is very difficult to get because that's why hippos are so dangerous. It's because usually it's the female, the mother, protecting the calf. Yeah, no, and then yeah. you but that's you obviously you drown it, right? That's what I do. What? The, Go ahead, the baby snake? hippo, you gotta drown it. You can't really drown a hippo. They live in water. You yeah, can but drown they don't, anything. But they don't have uh, gills. No, you keep it but underwater they could be long under enough for it's a while. Die. Yeah, they can be there for a while. They can you be there for a long ass time. Casey Abs here actually has a really good comment here. That snake is bussing and has riz. Yeah. Wasn't there a TV show where a guy got swallowed by a snake on purpose? That's actually, I actually don't know. I, that I might be love, David Blaine. I would love to see that, whatever yeah. it is. Yeah. David Blaine. I want to. But it might, he might do that because sounds, David Blaine is. I don't know, it sounds like a mind freak. Mind freak. <laughs> Marcus, how do you feel about rabbits? Uh, I like them. You like them? Yeah, I guys, like rabbits. Do you guys kill them a bunch on the uh, out on the property? Let's uh, like get two into how many more animals he kills. 
I I mean, everybody well, Marcus gets upset. doesn't kill him. I don't his kill. family but kills everybody him. Everybody gets upset. Um, with how many times his family is murdered. Everything. No, we don't really shoot rabbits okay. all that much. You ever no, eaten rabbit? You, yeah, you cannot. No, yeah, I have. It was fine. I I've eaten rabbit, rabbit a couple times. It's very delicious. Yeah, it can be good, man. Stew? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah buddy. It's very good. I've no, had just didn't... straight up roast rabbit. It's good. I've had fucking rabbit um, in a ravioli. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's true. It was good. Well, here's an emotional rabbit video. If we can skip ahead a little bit, Eric. Just thinking uh, about that anaconda. I'm hungry as hell. I'm yeah, starving. I'm actually really hungry, too. Yeah. yeah I want to I wanna eat a big hit. Well, this might help you lose your appetite. Hey, man, no, honestly, I don't get sick. This real homie right here. Look, homie done passed away, and he ain't leaving his side. Hey, homie, <laughs> I know so you. I know it probably hurts, bro. We got to get out the road, G. Get out the road. I know, How I nice know. This guy Damn, is. homie. Oh. Oh, I've been watching man. Alone a lot. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, bro. Oh, the lady I, who makes rabbit No, I didn't do it. Yeah, you saw that? Yeah, no, I didn't do great. it, G. You watch Man, I'm sorry, oh. homie. Fuck, Look bro. Look at that, he loves him. Oh. Damn, you ain't leaving your homie side, bro? Oh, oh. man, that's sad, G. Fuck, that's sad. Oh, what, what you been doing? Yeah, you know, you humping <laughs> a nigga? God damn, you a He's savage. Done. Stop, dude. <laughs> Horniness never stops. <laughs> Doesn't stop. You don't know. You still do it. I've told Natalie I'm gonna feel him one last time if I find her dead. Just what? But she's got to be warm. She said that. And she and she gave me permission. She says if she's warm, it's okay. Okay. It's okay. not full how, intercourse. How warm? Real warm. <laughs> okay, so like within 30 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. She said that. She said it's okay. All right. But she was kind of upset. She's like, so your first thought would be you found me dead. You would have a sexual thought. I was like, no, it's about connection. Mm. So yeah, it's about remembrance. It's about remembering them. One last time. One yes. more again. Mm. One more again. One more come. again. One more again. <laughs> Spud, Eaten Alive is an American Nature documentary special which aired in Discovery Channel. The special was also purportedly to feature Rosalie being eaten by an anaconda, protected by a suit designed specifically for this purpose. I remember this. Wow. We gotta find this. He attempted to feed himself to an anaconda, but the snake did attack. It did not swallow Rosalie as the title of the special implied. Yeah, but doesn't it just like smother you and kill you before it eats you? I mean, I think it bites you. And then it like puts itself around your neck. Yeah, yeah. it bites you, you and it yeah. chokes you to death. Yeah, and then it swallows you. But it, the bite's bad too. Yeah, the bite's not going to feel good. I, my, yeah, I like a hug. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't want to be hugged to death. Mm. Especially if something all big and stinky. I mean, it'd be different if it was a bunch of, like, oh, God, I can't even imagine being hugged to death by you. Oh, my God. It would take a couple minutes. I yeah. can imagine. Yeah. <laughs> I can imagine. I just want to be, I, but you remember China? Someone like that. That's oh, yeah. definitely, that's what gets, Technically, that's one of my last will and testament. Is to be uh, hugged, hugged to death by China? Smothered to death by either my wife's buttocks mm -hmm. or I, I would like to hope some other pair cool because china's dead yeah you're not allowed i to know but somebody else that ship has i'm sailed. just saying big beefy woman big okay. beefy woman smother you to death it, 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 that, and that's like if you're unresponsive brain dead that's how it happens we'll see how sick i am find a warrior princess to take you down nothing would make me happier fuck yeah what's her name from um what's her name from um hey, what's name? lucy lawless yep she's not that big no, she's not. She's just uh, looks She was just a warrior woman. She was just yeah. hot in that show. Yeah. Yeah. Bruce Campbell's in that show. Jack Jumper, ha ha, the woman with her baby next to me moved seats. <laughs> <laughs> we did it! Yeah, yeah. Buddy. Uh, that, that, we rush the cabin! Uh, for you! Uh, rush the cabin! For you, man! <laughs> Hell yeah! Way to go, bro. Oh, Margo says, job. I want the jellyfish videos again! Yes! Yes, you can you find them on your own. Don't yeah. make, about me, it today don't on make me watch them again. We talked about side stories today. You were more reasonable today. Well, I mean, I was more reasonable to a point. So but you listened to, to more. I still said I was not convinced. But you listened more today. Yes, because it was a two-person show. And, and you I had, had no to engage me. I had to. I was forced to engage you. There was it's not just a nice third to know. buffer. Yeah, He's exactly. just to see. But you see, he did. But you see. I didn't engage. I didn't engage. Marcus, you're going to love this woman. Good. This is, this is someone. This is I felt. I thought of you the moment I saw this. Thank you. All right. Let's check that. It's nature. Back to nature, but Love not nature. really. Love nature. Yeah. <clears throat> Your tail looks a little dirty to me. I love this woman. Yes. Ooh. This is yes. This is definitely incoming. <gasps> I could have seen Marcus with this woman at some point. I really, honestly, <laughs> yeah. felt like if they had met at a different yes, time Ashkar. period, Marcus would have been married to this woman. Staying alive. Staying alive. And then the breath of life, which means pinch off. 
Oh yeah, this is ferret. No, this is this is possum ferret yoga. Massaging. Yeah, it's possum We're yoga. so happy to oh, yeah. be here with you in 2020. I'd like to see <laughs> Man, she's still you going. to join me in prayer. So oh, this so woman's way Jesus. too into her possums. We are praying that all those you don't noisy tell me. planes just fall out of the sky. That's <laughs> death. That's <laughs> just a life lesson there. You said a possum when you met a possum. Uh, squirrel, so small, like... but it's clearly yeah, they're just a possum. Awesome. A... a possum. A possum. A possum. Oh, no. Incoming. She farts? Ah, God. I wish you would fart. <laughs> Marcus, I see you, right? I see you Who filming. Best. Well, in this case... Oh, my case, God. I could see you doing this, Marcus. Sir, I could see you with the possums. You see I mean, I love possums. They're great, but... within you. You pick up a possum. Because she's a beautiful you woman. There's a lot possum. going on I am after so the... Busy she's like a possums. beautiful, classy woman. No, she is a beautiful, classy woman, but like... Behind, after the camera turns off. Oh, you gotta have a whole life filled with possums. Yeah, there's gonna Need be pearl. a lot of problems. Yeah, there's gonna be like you can't, I, you can't I take mean, just you can't take that woman home. Up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you could take that woman home, or you just have to bring a bunch of possums with you. Yeah, don't go to her home. No, I know that much. Yeah, no, bring She's her to not, your that house. Never getting on a plane. Yeah, like you're not leaving the neighborhood. I would tell you about the time Julie was at Starbucks with Rambo, and then the person Rambo just started going crazy, and he's just like barking and screaming at the woman in front of him, in front of Julie, and then the woman's like, "I'm sorry, does he hate squirrels?" And we're like, "Yeah, he fucking yeah, hate, yeah, yeah, yeah." Most dogs squirrels. do. Most dogs have an, an, an reaction yeah. to squirrels. And yeah. then she was like, "Oh, uh, I, I smell like squirrels." <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, like what? "All right, let me just fucking go. I gotta go." That's how I'd be like, "All right, so I, I live like, with five squirrels. I just gotta go all lady. over me all the time. Lady, so I, I smell like squirrels. Nowhere so get near away me. From the dog. Yeah, get nowhere <laughs> near me. You are covered in squirrel jizz. You are legitimately a problem. You're gonna get rabies. You're gonna get something worse. You're gonna get like some virus is gonna jump from the squirrel to the human, and then we're all fucked." Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's what happened the last time. Yep. Oh, got left. Oh, you know yeah. I mean? Squirrels also, like, because I have seen it. They are, I've been, I'm in a war right now. Oh, with the squirrels? Yes, because. You gotta borrow Cena's yeah. dog, let him kill it all. I love squirrels. I actually yeah. actively like squirrels and I encourage squirrels. But then squirrels found one of our outdoor pieces of furniture and destroyed it. Oh, yeah, they ripped up your furniture. Thing. They fucked up furniture. And then apparently. That's true war. This is true war. This is the thing, man. You know what they said about the fuck? I looked it up. How to stop it. I was like, maybe squirt lemon juice or something on there, do stuff like that. They said the only way to stop them is to leave out a pillow that they can use <laughs> and give them a distracting pillow. I was like, I am not negotiating with these little creatures. I already have these. We're feeding them every day because we got a fruit tree. So they're eating the fruit tree. I'm not fucking That's stopping that process. That's all those fucking half-eaten oranges all over your front yes, yard. Yes, the squirrels eat the trees. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. You figure the acid would fuck with them. No, they love them. And so I just don't understand. And they're like, oh, you just leave out something else for them to destroy. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Well, now you have something for them to leave out to destroy. But that was a nice thing, and it now was I, nice. I was going to go get it re-upholstered. You're going to have to now. But yeah. then apparently they said that it will. they'll go after the same one no matter what. Well, at least they stick with one. I just got to fucking... I got to get a gun. I don't know if you need a gun, because I don't think you're going to be good at aiming and shooting. Hitting, but... a, <laughs> hitting a squirrel. Bah, bah, bah. Hitting most a squirrel is real is, hard. No, most of the time it's just having it. What was that happening? Yo, you guy? think what? what the, the McCoy? Oh, Squirrel Hunting Sam. You come Squirrel out there as soon as they see me, man. And I just cook it, pull it out. And they see it, they're all gonna be like, oh shit! <laughs> Leave them pouches alone! <laughs> and then bop, 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 you know? A couple yeah. of those. I just get blanks. That's great. Can we do a rock and roll ending? That's of course of to course. a rock and roll ending. Anytime, All right. always. All right. For this, this Marcus, this is particularly for you. Oh, thank Whoa, you. Tyler says I've gone through a squirrel fight. Get an owl decoy. Move it around every day. It's the only thing that works. That's a great idea. No fucking way. What if I dress like an owl? No, just <laughs> buy the statue. <laughs> You're not a fucking Hooters dog. Pull out the fucking gun. That's just as an owl. <laughs> That's one righteous owl. Rock and roll me, Eric. This is very impressive. Wow. Wow. It's incredible. <laughs> she's like, she's incredible.
Yeah. Ham. 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 Bring it at home, Ham. lady. Ham. Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> It's unbelievable! Woo! And Skinner, baby! Ah, it's incredible. Man. You thought Skinner couldn't get worse. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> that was incredible. That was great. Good work. Yeah. 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 Well, this has been the, the third ham day. That's yeah, a wonderful you ham day. We got it in there. Yeah. Great week. How oh, we're gonna be back here next week doing the same thing. Yeah. Who's who's in charge next week? Uh, uh, staff picks next week. Staff picks. Yeah, yeah, staff nice. mandate. Yeah, I can't wait. No, it's going to be scarring. It's always disgusting when it's a staff mandate. That's my yeah. favorite. I, I love, love that, it. Though. I love it. I love that about them. Um, and this has been wonderful. Thank you, mm -hmm. our wonderful Patreon subscribers. You, yeah. did good, you did a great job. Thank you. Uh, go girl users. Go girl users. 37%. Dry? Thirty-seven percent of Go Girl users have been are dry at the end of the process. Sixty-two percent wet. Sixty-two percent are so thirty-seven percent know how to use it, and it's not good. <laughs> well, actually, I don't think you say know how to use it. I just don't know if it's necessarily always. There's different styles. Yeah, or yeah. they have smaller vaginas. We should have ended this. Show. I think the urethra is the same no matter what. I don't know. I don't know if they're bad or like urethras the, it, or not. It's not like the piss come, comes through the hole like a you know like a tunnel. I got a cousin named Urethra. Urethra Franklin. Great singer. I'm a ham guy. <laughs> He's a ham guy. He's a ham guy. See you next week, fuckers. Bye, y'all. We'll finish it. Oh. Could you just shove a ladder in there? What yeah, that's gonna, what else are you going to do? What are they going to pull out? Well, they, if is it's it going to be a full person? I love the music. It's added by Eric. Eric. Oh! Wow. Hey, oh, wait, 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 wait.